Hey, I would like to talk a bit about joy, excitement, gratitude. Um, I um, watched the movie Unrest, which is a documentary about ME, ME CFS, and I had this huge awareness around this when I did, because um, this is really intense. It was like this. <clears throat> this lady who has been really, really sick, so sick she was just lying in bed. She couldn't sit up, she couldn't... Um, yeah, she was just lying in bed. <clears throat> and then one day they, uh, with the support of her dad, she was sitting up in the bed. And she hadn't for such a long time. And, <laughs> and she was even sitting there and, and with her touching the toes to the to the floor and to look at her and the excitement and the joy I mean that was like priceless that was one of the most intense joy that I've seen anyone show and how she thought that was so crazy she was like I, I, I'm touching I'm touching the ground with my toes it's, it's like it's mental you know and, and her father asked, when you d did you do that the last time? It was like, it was years ago that she did that. And that made me realize how I, it got so clear how I, so that, that really flipped things for me that I, I started to see then really clearly how I make myself wrong for sometimes when I'm excited, when I'm um, happy about things because it's too small. Anyone else ever do, has, ever, <laughs> has ever done that, you know? Uh, and I saw this idea we have that something has to be sort of monumental, huge or like super exciting or super whatever in order for us to allow ourselves to be the happiness and the excitement and gratitude we be. Um, how does it get better than that? And so seeing her, how excited and happy and grateful she was for being able to sit up and touch the floor, I mean, which seems like <laughs> nothing to most people, but to her it was because she hadn't for years. And um, like if I take an example from, from my life, I live in this very small village and um, I rarely go even into town, it's like uh, 40, minute, uh, 40 minutes with a bus and that's this huge thing for me. So the few times when I can do that, um, I'm like, I'm, I'm so excited. It was would be like for like a normal non-sick person maybe to um, travel to Africa or, you know, whatever that I would sort of like... <laughs> resemble the I mean I, I'm just I'm just so thrilled and there are people and you know I watch what they're wearing and you know it's move, moving things and there are like lights and there are all these things and I'm just so so excited uh, and at the same time I make myself wrong because yeah this is nothing just going into Costa you know I should just and and it's like how bizarre and stupid is that and um, so for me, sort of what I can do is regulate it with like what's going on in my body and all that limitations. So that like gets to be my reference frame. But I, I mean, it doesn't have to be someone being having something limiting going on in the body like that. Um, it can be like, you know, how much it, it got me wondering how much are we everyone limiting the joy, excitement, the gratitude we feel for things because we think it's too small so I shouldn't feel this much or like embody this much of the joy or show this much joy because uh, this thing is a too small thing to be this excited about, you know. Like what if we just step into being the excitement and joy and gratitude we be? Like look at children, you know. They can just, you know, 
uh, slam, you know, uh, they just, you know, whatever, they are playing and moving some toys or slamming something and just, you know, doing it and they're like, oh my god, and then they're just laughing hysterically and just, you know, what if we be like that, you know, I think that's more like the true, true us and uh, yeah, so how much have you limited, have been, how much have you been, sorry, it's a little like, my body doesn't function so well the first hours in the morning. Uh, so trying to talk like this is a little... Okay, anyway. So how, <laughs> what I wanted... <laughs> I so want to tell another story now. I'm like this, they say in access when you have this ADD, ADHD, OCD and autism going on. It's like... <laughs> okay, but I'm just, I'm just, I'm just... I want to try and do a little bit shorter videos to just, to say one, talk about one, one thing. I was very tempted now. Uh, and now I forgot what, what I was talking about. What was I talking about? Uh, yes. How much have you been limiting your gratitude, your excitement, um, your joy of living? Uh, because, uh, uh, yeah, you turned it into wrongness to be that much of that with small things, you know? What if you just be for, not even a thing at all, for just for like, what if you just be it? For absolutely no reason, um, and uh, also for the small things. Um, so uh, that was the immense contribution for this uh, lady with ME who hasn't been sitting up for years, who showed me the energy of uh, her excitement and joy for being able to just fucking touch the floor with her toes. How does it get better than that? Okay, <laughs> thank you so much for watching. Bye.